Of football, Tennessee Bowl Prep continues with the balls inching closer to the 75th Gator Bowl. WATE 6 on your side, Sports Director Marshall Hughes is in Jacksonville with a recap as the balls continue to get ready for Thursday's game. Good morning from Jacksonville, where the Vols are now just two days away from the 75th annual Gator Bowl. This morning, the Vols will be testing their golf skills at Top Golf. That's a sport that Trey Smith says he's yet to perfect. Man, I can't even swing a golf club. They never have my size, so it's just like I've never had a, a real like chance. Monday, providing food, fun, and football for the Vols. Tennessee was invited to visit the Mayport Naval Station, home to some of the largest U.S. Navy ships in the world. This is a great opportunity for uh, for us sailors to kind of share our uh, our experiences in the Navy and share our ship, and this is a great time for the players to kind of see what we do. This is right up my alley. Anytime you get to go be around people who get to protect our country, it's something that's a true honor. This is real life right here. What we do with football is not real. This is entertainment. This stuff is real. And so it's good for our guys and for me to get around this and to show our respects. Tennessee treated to barbecue before walking aboard the USS Billings for an up-close look at one of the fastest ships in the Navy's fleet. We're talking over 40 knots. That's faster than a racehorse can run on land. Right? So that's how fast our ships are. And then they have multiple capabilities, the newest technology, and uh, th that's what these, these, these uh, players are going to see today. A new experience for the Vols and also for the Navy's Brian Reynolds and Matt Loeffler, who both grew up Vols fans in Tennessee. It is absolutely incredible. Uh, as soon as I found out that, uh, that the Vols were going to be here, uh, I absolutely, it was ecstatic. I was ecstatic, and uh, it is absolutely a dream come true. For them to be able to to be here and us be able to host them here on our base. I mean, being in the military, I've gotten to do and see a lot of great things, but this is definitely top of the list to, you know, see your team come on board your ship where you work and get to meet them and stuff. It's amazing. Big Orange making a quick turnaround to the practice field on Monday, where Jeremy Pruitt was pleased with his team's effort. You know, it's good practice. Our kids uh, have been focused the entire bow prep and. Um, it was a good first day. Coach Peru is keeping everybody on task. He's making sure everybody's focused, ready to go. Uh, that we're down here for one goal. That's to beat Indiana. And so uh, I'm really, really impressed with how this bowl preparations go. I think it's, it's my third bowl game. And so uh, I'm getting to see that, hey, this, we're right in line. Monday's practice here at the University of North Florida, the last one open to the media. So the next time we'll see Tennessee on the field will be at TIAA Bank Field, home of the Jaguars, Thursday night against the Indiana Hoosiers. In Jacksonville with the Vols, Marshall Hughes for Good Morning Tennessee.